So if you've experienced a sport-related knee injury when you're young, you have a six-fold increased risk of developing osteoarthritis than somebody who hasn't had that injury. Another way to state that is that about 50% of people that have a significant knee joint injury, and again, most commonly that is gonna be as a result of sport or recreational activities, will develop osteoarthritis within five to 10 years. So the SOAR program, or Stop Osteoarthritis, is a new knee health program. It's virtually delivered, so it's accessible to anyone who has access to the internet. And basically, it is a program that helps people who've had a previous knee joint injury navigate their knee health and reduce their risk for osteoarthritis once they've been discharged from care for that knee injury. SOAR consists of education, a home-based exercise and physical activity program with tracking, and one-to-one -one physiotherapy counseling. So the unique aspect of the SOAR program is that there isn't a standardized exercise and physical activity program. The exercise and physical activity program that participants use are based on goals that are co-developed with physiotherapists that address the priorities that they have for their own physical activities, their own sport, their own needs. SOAR works by increasing the confidence that someone has to manage their own knee health. We know that people that have had a joint injury are at increased risk of developing osteoarthritis and that risk never goes away. And it's unrealistic that they're gonna continue to get care over that 10 or 15 year period before they develop osteoarthritis. So SOAR gives them the tools to manage their own knee health over that period of time and hopefully it will make them less likely to gain weight, to stay more physically active, and reduce their overall risk for osteoarthritis. So currently there aren't really a lot of osteoarthritis prevention programs. Some work has been done to try to reduce obesity as a risk factor for osteoarthritis but there aren't a lot of programs that target people after they've had a joint injury. So really early on before they develop the signs and symptoms of osteoarthritis. Probably two most unique things about the SOAR program is that we're focusing on young people that are at increased risk of osteoarthritis because they've had a joint related injury. So people in their 20s and their 30s. And then the second thing is that the program is very individualized. It's not a standardized program where everyone gets the same exercises. We really work with individuals to identify what their priorities are and to develop a program that meets their needs. In my clinical practice, I can't tell you how many times I've seen somebody who has knee osteoarthritis and they say to me, why didn't I know about this 20, 30 years ago? Why wasn't someone telling me 20 or 30 years ago that this is what I needed to do to manage my knee health so that I didn't develop osteoarthritis? So what I'm hoping the SOAR program will do is it will provide those answers to people so that they can be proactive, look after their own knee health, and be less likely to develop osteoarthritis.